So what are stall planes? Stall planes are a specific type of aircraft that's designed with short takeoff and landing. Hence the name. It's always quite funny when you're filming a video and someone drives by and gives you a really weird look. Before we get started, if you can hit that subscribe button and like this video, it really helps us out. So short takeoff and landing planes are fantastic for quite a few reasons. They're relatively inexpensive and they often come in a kit form so you can build them yourself. Some forms come factory built. Oftentimes, stall planes are experimental which means that you can do whatever you want you can put whatever engine you want in it whatever avionics you want in it and you can there aren't really many rules some of the more common engine manufacturers for stall planes are continental lycoming and viking there's heaps of others, but these are the main three. Part of the reason why I really like stall planes is that the reason how they are a stall plane is because they're a top wing is massively oversized for the size of the plane. So because the wing is so big, this is why it's able to take off in such a short distance. And it also means that it's really stable as well during flight compared to a mid wing or a low wing. The three biggest stall plane manufacturers are Kit Fox, Cub Crafters and Rands. These are all a little bit different. In my opinion, the Rands is the best one. It's got the best mix of takeoff distance, payload and cruising speed, as well as it's a metal plane. The Kit Fox is the wings are made from wood and canvas and the whole rear section of the plane is just a fabric covering over the steel skeleton. So, and also if I was to build one, I don't really want to be playing around with chemicals and, and putting a fabric covering around the rear of the plane. It just sounds like a disaster. Plus, I live in Australia it gets really hot here and it also rains a lot the humidity and moisture would not be ideal on the wooden wings I'm just thinking about this in a logical manner I've never owned one but wood and moisture don't go very well together so I would rather a metal plane the Cub Crafters carbon cup is an excellent option however it's incredibly expensive it's about 250 to three hundred thousand dollars it is one of the best stall planes that you can buy these stall planes are actually really efficient to use often using anywhere from four and a half to six gallons an hour at cruise speed which is which is about as good as it gets now cruise speed on on a stall plane is not its best strength it's normally one of its worst so the Rams s21 has got the highest cruise speed of about 240 to 250 kilometers an hour now this varies on the propeller the engine what sort of tires you have how much payload how much like there are so many variables but the s21 has the best cruising speed the highest cruising speed the cub cross Crafters has the best short takeoff and landing. However, a lot of people have modified them further and have gotten them to take off in about three or four feet, which is just ridiculous. Overall, if you're a beginner pilot or you just want to get into air to airplanes and flying, stall planes make an excellent option. I myself would like to purchase or build my own stall plane. It would likely be the Rans S21 with either a Rotax or a Viking engine. It would probably be the 914 IS, the turbocharged variation. However, <laughs> those engines are really expensive. Let me know if this is something that you'd like to see. So we've had heaps of growth on the channel in the last four weeks, which is fantastic. But if you guys can hit that subscribe button and like button below, it really helps me out. I've also got a website where I'm selling some merch. Feel free to check it out. All profits from the merch go straight back into making more videos. We've got a fantastic video coming up soon where I'm getting a free car and we're gonna do some science experiments on it. So stay tuned for that.